Oh, look how great it looks. <laughs> Do they come with jewelry in them? <laughs> of course. <laughs> you know what that is. Right, Gucci? Yes. <laughs> look. Going to get another storage locker. We're going to open it up and see what's inside. Oh. One of these doors. Huh. Got to come over here on this side. This one looks pretty interesting. I will say, when I was looking at this one bidding on it, the stuff looked a lot farther away. I knew the size of it, but boy, does it seem bigger. So it's definitely smaller. Yeah, I mean, we knew it was small, but this box looked like it was like 25 feet away from the camera in the picture. <laughs> well, let's just find out what's in here. Oh, there's actually two torque coils. We've got a uh, drive belt for the car, I guess, and cards. Before we get like this out of here because I think this might be garbage. I want to check and make sure. What is it? Oh, it went to a sewing machine. Oh, here was something I was wondering. Oh, this is where you put your bike to turn it, convert it into a. Oh, like an exercise? Yeah, yep. Uh, that's, I oh, actually. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool though. I think I used to want one of these a lot, way long time ago. This one looks like just packaging material. What is that? Feels like something. Like, feels like leather. It's a nice piece of leather, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, this side does feel like leather, also. Okay. Maybe this might might be a little better than it seems. Maybe. What did we pay for this one? One forty. Yeah, I think we paid up because it was indoors. But the lockers have have been. It's been tough bidding lately. Really tough bidding. And They're either sky high or it's just nothing good in there. Yeah. So we got quite a few boxes to yeah. hopefully hit something good in here. Well, let's see what's in this. <laughs> oh, these are bad. These are clamps, obviously. Oh, what is that? There's a machine in the bottom. Oh, that's a Rockwell, and it may be a planer. Well, you know what? No, it's a, a belt sander. It's worth something. Somebody will buy it. Oh, we're not up to 140 yet. <laughs> oh, yeah, probably not. All the lockers are a bit of a risk, I guess. They're always somewhat of a gamble. It says leather on it. Oh, it's from Ann Taylor. Not to be confused with Ann Klein. Okay. Or maybe to be confused with that. More material. Yeah. It's got this, a pattern on it. Hmm. <laughs> Weird. This, I don't know. Probably wasn't cheap when I bought it. Grab the jewelry box. Yeah, uh, okay. kick some excitement up in this. Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. <laughs> oh, look how great it looks. Do they come with jewelry in them? <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh. Not new, well, so. Yeah. We'll get that tape off of there because we don't need that. Do you feel like there's something in it? It looks like there is. What? Yeah, there is. There's something <laughs> in it. This is exciting. So this locker just, just one box went to maybe being, to very least being exciting. That looks like costume so far. Yeah. So that which, one over there. I don't mind getting that stuff. Do you? That's something similar probably. You know I should have brought a darn hard loop. This is when I was learning about listing some listing jewelry. I always liked listing the clip-on earrings and everything. I got to know quite a few good ones, but I don't know. I still do like listing them. St. John, it's a, unless that's from like a location or something. St. John is like a really, really good luxury brand to find. Let's see if there's... Oh, oh. oh. Sad. Sad. There's still Sad two face. more. Sad face. Oh, there's something in there. Oh, nothing really there. This is a nice jewelry box, though. Yes, it is. And it's, we will definitely get something decent for this. Probably not enough to pay for, definitely not enough to pay for the locker by itself. We should put it back in here. Okay. Oh, what's the price there, say? It was $65 oh. from wherever it came from. Oh, it says Worthington. Maybe it was from actually that store. Maybe this is like... 
a Rembrandt or something. You want me to take, take this picture or you want me to take switch places with you? Oh, it is. It's a Monet. <laughs> it's a Monet. Monet, yep, yeah. Definitely. It's getting tongue tied there. Oh, Actually, it is signed. It is signed. I'll have to look that one up. Yeah, just in it case. It is a uh, nice looking painting. Yeah, they actually, it actually does look like it is painted and everything. It's pretty. Yeah, it is. What's this? This thing? That is a Texas Instruments TI-82, an older graphing one. Not, probably not bad. I don't, I don't think those are as valuable as the 84s. It's an adapter, empty adapter box. Graph link. So you can hook it up to the computer. I've never yeah, had this or not. I wonder if this is. Oh, I was about to ask if it was obsolete. No. Floppy. <laughs> let's see what is now. Let's see what the heck this is. Oh, oh it's an iPad one. <laughs> this is something I haven't used. It's a view screen. Okay, I'll just go ahead and say I think it's probably verging on obsolete, but. <laughs> People do love all that. I, I say that, and I used to actually purposely look for. Sometimes you get surprised when you research it. Yeah, and when I was oh, there are multiples of these. Oh, they're numbered. Wow, well, I wonder if this came from the school. Yeah, it's beginning to look that way. Wow, <laughs> no, that's not bad. You're not twenty bucks a piece. Yeah, that's because you know, like I wouldn't purposely go looking for calculators to sell that were like twenty or under, but. Well, this one's got but that could pay for the locker right there is yeah my point. that's what it, once you have a stack of them it should make it's, it's definitely something different click one on see if it works see this one's an 82 but look it has a something on the back no we'll figure those out though let's see what else is in here oh there's a manual apparently we're gonna have to read that entire thing before we sell one <laughs> <laughs> So I think that leather is going to be good. There were like 14 pieces. I would imagine we're going to get like 20 bucks a piece for those. But what is this? See, if this bag says Radio Shack. Oh, it looks like a microphone. I don't know. I know sure microphones are worth pretty good money. There are a few brands. Probably worth something though. Check that out. See what we get, what it's worth. This is probably the stand. Oh, that's a Sure bag. It says right. That's the one I was looking. Oh, look at that. It's a little, got a lot of wear. Somebody definitely use this thing. Can't even read the which one it is. Old, Looks like an oldie. Yeah, I'll test it out though and see if it still works. We have the stuff to test that with. Those are those are good microphones though. Even the old, even though that style takes the cord. They're not not a wireless or anything, but they're still worth worth something. We actually just sold one a couple weeks ago. Oh, good call. Oh, all the cords. These are microphone cords. I forget what we call that, like X something or other. I forget. Uh, a couple miscellaneous video cords, stuff like that. This is probably pretty good stuff here. Not huge amounts of money though, but what is that? Four cords. Now, even if we did flea market, they're probably worth at least five to ten. I don't know. They might be worth a little more online. Microphone. I don't know. Yeah, let's get our enough. whatnot going. We still got all them amp cords and everything else. Yeah. Oh, that one thing. has been a really. Yeah, I know. I have super high hopes for that, but it's been because we make all our money elsewhere right now. It's been super hard to get that going. It's a lot heavier than I thought it was going to be. Agro. It's upside down. Agro X. Oh, I forgot to mention that sewing box or that box that I took out that said Mitsubishi that was empty. That was actually an industrial sewing machine. So I don't know. Pretty, I think a fairly good sign for this type of locker. There are some things. That start making. Have some higher hopes for these. Ooh, more leather. It sure does look like leather. Ooh, this looks like a nice piece. Look how oh, that's, that yeah, is. that's a heavy piece there. This one does look like they were working out of it for sure. So some of those other ones, I think they were full cowhides or something. I kind of was thinking it but not saying it like what what I was what I thought I might be seeing like these that have the type of shape oh that one maybe was cut but some of these um they have an odd shape to them to begin with I know I've looked at them before that leather too that's yeah really that, thick that is a very nice piece of pebbled leather we have to do some little research on this this stuff 
may actually. Why don't we give everybody a look at it, including us, so we know. Oh, there's some. Black suede. Black suede, yep. Tan suede. So this one's there's on the back, too. Oh, you gotta look at the other I side, too. Stuff wasn't cheap. Look. This might be a. That was like, it has a print on it, maybe. Look. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Should have bought that chair that was at the antique mall. Oh, now man. we got tons of leather to re actually reupholster it. I don't know. That's kind of backer or something. That's not actually fabric. That piece down there. So well, there's some very nice material in here. So there's definitely going to be some money in these things. But I kind of thought those other pieces were going to be easily worth like 20 bucks a piece, and there were like 14 of them. This looks like something that would have had a roll. Says. That was interesting. This is where you go and you get surprises, things that you wouldn't normally look for or expect. You never but know what you find in a locker. That is <laughs> absolutely true. I hope this is not leather. But we've sold a lot of fabric over the years. Yeah, some of it's worth a lot of money. Yeah. We've got actually done quite a bit. We've sold quite a bit of money this year. This year worth of fabric. Quilting fabric. We still have some left. Yeah. There's some of that that's actually sold almost right away too for I don't know, those little boxes that are for like what eighty ninety dollars for a little box of fabric. This okay, more fabric. Yeah, more of it to look through. Just in case people want to get a look at it, some more suede. This one's oh looks like a crocodile print or alligator, whichever. That one has some sort of texture to it, pattern. That's another pattern. Actually, we had the same. It's this more fabric. Ooh, that's some interesting stuff, though. Red suede. That's a cool red, though. Yeah, it is. You know what? I wonder if they have it in here so it doesn't stain the other one. Ooh. I'm gonna put it right back in there, just in case. Brass. Copper, I think. Or, yeah, it's kind of Oh, that is heavy copper there. Holy smokes. So it's a very thick little copper. They were probably going to make something. Or had been making something with this stuff and saving the pieces. Something to go with whatever this is. It's one of those things. <laughs> <laughs> it's a thing I dig. <laughs> yeah. But. I don't know what it, I feel bad scrapping that, but these for sure, those have like a wind chime or I don't know. Who knows? Scrap weight's worth quite a bit in copper, and those are quite heavy. Uh, I think that's empty. It's like a shoebox to me, but this has some stuff. It doesn't say it's photographs. Oh. Same glass case. Oh, we got that same one. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> I think ours has a pull on it though. <laughs> There's nothing in there. I don't think. I should probably take a good look. Could be the most valuable thing in the whole locker. <laughs> it's uh, not empty. And that doesn't go there. I have a garbage box over there. I'll fix that in a minute. Oh, what is this cool thing? Is that just candy or something? What on earth? I have the foggiest idea. Doesn't have a smell either. I don't know what that it's is. It's a weird thing to do. Rio. Could have been poison in there. Yeah, I probably should have tasted it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Two laces. Okay, nothing special. These are handy, but a bunch of sharpies. Okay, stuff. So, oh, I think something possibly good right here. Oh, uh, maybe not. You know what that is? Fake Gucci? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> It does have a tag, says made in Italy. I don't know. It could be just really, really old, too. That actually feels like leather, believe it or not. Hmm. I don't know. Don't usually see that on too many Gucci's, though. But this, if, well, it's clearly super old either way, real or fake. Lint brush. Metal. Oh, what's this? Jewelry box. Oh, darn. All these little tins sometimes are some of the 
good things to find. It's exciting, that's for sure. It's like it was an old Boy Scout buckle up belt or something. Yeah, we've had a few really good ones so far. Alright, let's check this one since I was already saying something. Fishing pole. Sturdy stick. Shakespeare. I guess it's, uh, it is definitely a vintage. It's in pretty good shape too. That's pretty nice. I, I, I'll put it over here in the corner. Hopefully it doesn't. Looks like it could fall in the neighbor's locker. Let's <laughs> we'll see what's in here. Something about anthropology on it. It's spelled like the science, not the store. price on it. Oh, it actually says Anthropology the store on it, though. <laughs> so it looks like a set of these, whatever. Cool, I guess. Yeah, they are. I don't know why that, that one only had a $12 price tag, because that store is, is the stuff's a little bit expensive in there. Like they have super nice stuff, but... Matches. I wonder if they had some kind of little booth or something themselves. Some place where they sold some things. Oh, this one's a different shape. Same color, different style though. They're all the same pattern. For now, these are just getting put out of the way. And we'll, we'll pack them up right. Before we, before we go drive off with them. Uh -oh. That was a box of little odds and ends too, or papers or something. This is a bigger box. I'm starting to think this was a mannequin. I think it might be. I hope it's a mannequin and not the real thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think they were making like leather vests or something. Yeah. Yeah, they were yeah, I think you're probably right. That's a nice mannequin too. Either useful for us or worth something for sure. I know whenever I've wanted to buy a mannequin for selling clothing on that, it's looking locally, looking online. The same one at that antique mall, they had $99 on it. Right. And it was plastic. That was basically what I was going to say. It was very hard to find them under $100 or, or very much under. Maybe we found some from the $80 range, that sort of thing. But yeah, see, that one's shorter than the other one you took out. I think it just put. Is it? I think so. Yeah. You're absolutely right. Basically the same mannequin, just a different size. Oh, they have a stand on the bottom. Just put them on a stand if you want. Or a broomstick. Or a broomstick, is that what you said? Now this one is... It's like a piece of driftwood or something. I guess this one? Well, oh, you just peeked, so... Yeah, I did peek, so that's the rule. They gotta get opened. Once they peek, I gotta open them. Oh, I didn't recognize anything yet, though. Oh, yes, I did. I saw that. Some rubber flooring. Is this the mannequin stands? Uh, actually they're signs. Oh. Sign holders for a store or something. Actually, there's something cool under this box too. Stand for selling something. It is a scraper. What is that? Chess pieces or something? Interesting. Oh, it does say chess pieces on the side. Oh. They literally labeled everything so metal bar stock I thought it was like as in a a bar like where you keep your drinks but it's a bar as in like a piece of metal bar some sort of stock for welding or something and this nice acrylic stand yep yeah, looks like they were maybe $19. oh they're labeled oh they were labeled with money they went this way didn't it hey that's pretty cool what does it say I can't remember my glasses on Lobster claw. Oh, some old jewelry pieces, maybe? Yep. Cool. Yeah, that's pretty nice. These acrylic stands are not cheap. And these aren't cheap either. Yeah, you were been. Oh, look at those. These are nice too. Oh, wow, that's super heavy. It is very heavy. That's actually really nice. Obviously, a um, display stand. But what is this? That's all the wine oh. thing. Yeah, they, as a sticky, they were using it as a sign for sure, like you said. 
This one says more of that anthropology. I have the knife this time. Oh. So I don't know how to open it. What is my problem? Oh, it has a button. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Do you put the right combination in? Oh, is it more of the same pots? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> more matching stuff. Huh. More of the plant and garden supplies. Back oh. of miscellaneous, some steel wool. That's a nice spray bottle. Whoop. Take that. Yeah, nailed it. Crop guns in here, do it. Let me give you your liquid nails back. Okay. This looks like one of them. Uh... Oh, an outdoor grill? Oh, this thing. I mean, a rival <laughs> crack grill. <laughs> Smokeless indoor electric grill. Yeah. Oh, this one's heavy. I feel like you did this to me on purpose. Oh, no. You, I would have got that for you. Sorry. Way whack. Vegas is China set. So I just picked oh. up a whole box of dishes. Fancy tablecloths. Or, uh, uh, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, placemats. There you go. It's mini tablecloth. Oh, wine glasses. Man. Oh, that looked like a nice glass. Our flea market's going to be full of glasses this year. Oh, those are nice. They have the silver rim. Do they have any markings? Uh, they are nice. Look at these. Are, are tacky? Ivory oh. China. Noritake, that's a good, good brand if you're going to get China, Ooh, at least for it's me. Ooh, a pretty pattern. Oh, yeah. I don't know if we've had this one before or not. Yeah, this is a lot of different glasses. I haven't seen too much of the China yet. Oh, they are Happy nice, New Year's. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I picked this box up. Yeah, <laughs> I can't believe I didn't just, just yeah, sorry. Ooh, that one's pretty. Oh, that one is. Oh, Unmarked, though. I take that back. Mm -hmm. I'm just kidding. <laughs> that one's marked. Bone China. England. Coal clog. I don't know. Clog. Clog. I don't speak England. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. um, All different patterns. Oh, Paragon. I wonder if there's a teacup to match it. That's a good, that's a good brand to find a teacup in for sure. Oh, there's one that matches that set. Oh, good. Maybe there's a set. Do you have room to like um, to take? No, wait a minute. This is different. Uh, West Bend. I think so. Aristocraft. That's what it is. Chantilly lace pattern. There's tons of glasses. I saw that Paragon saucer. I'll be come out with it. I'm thinking maybe there's a cup to go with it. Not all of them, but that's one where you can occasionally find a oh, a teacup that you can get. I don't know some good money for. 100, 200, kind of rare, but. That one's pretty. Wow. It's so shiny. Did I see a mark somewhere? Oh, I see something right, right there. there. That is, oh, Shannon Crystal. That was made, by, I can't remember who that's made by. Uh, it just says Shannon Crystal Designs of Ireland. But we, we've had some of, some, sh some things that we had Shannon Crystal and I thought it was made by, I don't know, another well-known maker. Oh. oh. Is that our Paragon? Nope. Nope, much of that though. Oh. Nice. Oh, and this matches that other plate. Yeah. That set. And... Little hands. Oh, which one? Is that one marked? Can't yeah, remember. Just... Oh, that one. Well, we've done pretty well with some with cups and saucers before for sure individual ones make quite a bit of money on just one of them same one. oh yeah that's the matching one for that um shannon crystal that's a nice set okay i'm making a huge amount of okay i think you probably got through it it's either shoes or hand tools I 
watercolors and oh. like garden tools. Oh, that's a nice there. one. Sure feels like it. A, com a comfort weeder. Get enough of those. Yeah. You had my collection. I'm clean gloves. West Country. West County. I don't know what these are for. More garden stuff. Giant mirror. Oh, that's like a nice one. I was lighted too, appears to be. Appears to be. Yeah. I'm speaking like Yoda now. What are these? Oh, these are like weeding tools. Are you messing with them? No, I, no, actually, no, I'm totally serious. I think you, you can use these like for dandelions and things. Like you can go down low in the dirt and rip the seat, the root out for, further down. It looks like part of a hose nozzle. Bobby doing the heavy lifting? <laughs> oh, trap. I can't oh. lift that. I don't know what that is. Actually, that's all one piece, isn't it? Yeah. We could take this off. Oops. Got a motor in it. Oh, yeah. It was meant to spin. I was thinking it was for, at first, like some sort of powder's wheel type setup, but it sits at an angle. Let's see. What would they put, do that with? Tumbling stones, maybe, or something? Got this in here. It sit, it sits offset like that. And there's all oh, this goes on there. It must work like a dimmer switch. Put this back in there. Is it oh, sharp? In there. I wonder if it is for tum. No, my thought was for like tumbling rocks or something, but to polish them. But oh. this, what I thought. Oh, it's not as heavy. You know, because it looks like something. It would be filled with mortar bags and stuff, but it's not. Oh, this actually, I was talking about how nice this locker smells, and this right here does smell musty. That's musty. Yeah, I don't know if these are part of outdoor furniture or something. But that's staying wrapped up. It's a couple of boards oh, wrapped in plastic. That's right, I just got a small cedar and must. Yeah, maybe, I don't know what they're using for. If I'm going to ever try to find out, we're going to do that outside. It didn't look like anything. Oh, handing machine. It's an oldie. It sure is. Atlas glass. Slippery. My skin must be really dry again. Oh, actually, found something cool in here already. Micro cassette or mini cassette recorder. Oh, those are funny. Yeah, let's see if, which one it is. It's a GE. Got a little bit of signs of wear to it, but I bet you we can sell that. That's something good, though. See what it says on the top? It says Jewelry KJ. That says oh, Kitchen Glass. Uh, <laughs> oh, what is this? Sort of plastic container. So neither Atlas Glass nor Jewelry. Oh, this is stuff to put jewelry in, probably. Yeah. Well, those are pretty nice, though. Those would be pretty handy for, for some. If we knew somebody want this stuff. Flea market people want this stuff. Yeah. I was sitting down on the job. <laughs> Were you sleeping? I came back in and I heard you yawning. <laughs> okay, here we go. I have another locker to do. What do you mean? Today, tomorrow. Yeah. I think we only have until Monday. Yeah, because it's the weekend when we actually have a little extra time. What in the world? This is what they were tumbling in there. Oh. Oh. Like marble. Yeah. So we have a box of that. Nice IKEA shelves. Those stainless steel oh. ones. Yeah. Oh the top of uh, what is it? What is on this side over here? Yeah, those do look nicer. It's nice that it's solid. Those ones we got were bars yeah you can set things on them and they won't tip over like glasses and 
or fall through. That's how you want me to? Oh. Piece of marble. All right. Toy truck. Oh, there's stuff in it. Okay. The surprise. No, I couldn't tell what it was except for something. You're gonna drag it in. Yeah, I'll get it in. Where you want it? It's here. right here. Is it too high if I put it on the table? Yeah, we'll just do this. Okay. Bag of dirt. Oh. There's 140 bucks back right there. Yeah. <laughs> a strap. Nothing wrong with that. Is that more dirt? I think so. Some kind of potting stuff. I'm not sure what it is. Somebody went and told them dirt don't hurt. So at least. Yeah. Pretend they didn't say that. I don't know what that is. I can't, uh, I can't tell what they are either. Oh, they're some sort of flower buds or something. Maybe they're saving them for the seeds. Or portions of a flower. Mm, uh, drainage, micro grow. Perlite. Yep. My Dirt. Plastic bags. No more of those seeds, the flower pods, the flower. Oh, marigolds. Marigold. Red cedium. Is that the right word? I don't know if I got all the letters in that or not. Be impressed if I did. We got quite a few months to go before we can plan anything in Michigan. Sedum. Sedum? Right. Oh, oh no, now you did it. That's what the brew was for. Nice little oh. trunk though. Let me see. Oh my gosh. Should have told me this years ago. Oh, those are some old boxes. I say eBay on them. <laughs> Get it on eBay. Ship it with postal service. It does sound like eggs. <laughs> Fragile. Alternative shoes. More of those stands. Oh, all right. Those are pretty cool. Jewelry stuff. Oh, nice. Two of these? Yeah. Tops. Taller ones? Yeah. Oh, that's that nice. nice. Yeah. We don't have a taller one. I don't think we do, do we? That one's a little crooked, but maybe we can fix it. Um, oh, this is for earrings. Ah. Empty. Oh, that's a nice bag, though. What does it say? Uh, something squared. SR squared. Sandra, Sandra Roberts, I think it says. I don't know what to use it for, but that looks like it'd be nice for something. Not it's much for selling. Oh. Magic. Avillier. Oh. Or Abracadabra. That's I'm our generation. To... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Typical of our generation. Or wasn't I supposed to say open sesame? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's try it again. Open sesame. <gasps> <laughs> oh, thank you. I'm so happy now. <laughs> right here. Okay. Oh, this is oh wow. That is pretty cool. I feel what it feels like. Oh, it's real heavy too. Oh, it has, it has markings on the back. It says something right here too. It is, oh, silver plate on copper? National silver plate. It's got a couple Not of stamps. National silver something, I can't quite read it. One right there. Oh yeah. One right there. Oh, I was, I was getting confused by the copper, but the rims are silver plate. That's, I don't know. That's uh, probably something pretty nice. Is that the only thing in there? Here. Huh. I'm not complaining. I think this locker has been pretty decent so far for sure. Jewelry again. It's probably plat the I'm wondering if it's oh, more man. of the more displays for it or something. You know, it's hard when you see the word jewelry to not get excited or disappointed when it's just the display cases, but these aren't cheap though. That's exactly what I was gonna get at. Because these would be things that normally we'd be thrilled to get. 
more of those. I'll have to figure out how those sheets work, but they're more jewelry displays. Oh, interesting. Some cool pieces. Oh. There's a whole box full. Look at this oh. one. Oh, that is cool. Have we ever sold any of this? Something like this? I don't think so, but I don't again, think so. it's not something that's cheap. No, that's what I was going to say, and I know very little about selling Especially it. Especially if you go to a pet supply place. Yeah. They had like $49 on this. I was trying to remember where I've seen, where I've seen these things at. Uh, that maybe. Pack you. Oh, okay. I was thinking some of those little uh, decor type shops. Oh, is this the last one? Is there anything in the corners? Nope. Last box. Ooh. Well, let's see. If we keep a tra tradition going, it'll either be book or empty bags or something. <laughs> let's see what it is. Oh. I actually know what that is already, that brand at least. Oh, these could be anything in those boxes though, huh? Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, it looks like something new. Oh, computer is a hard drive hard or something. Drive. There's a piece right here. Hmm. You're just assuming it was super old, right? Yeah. It, it did look like. Oh. Oh wow. Huh. Yep. Some crafty person's gonna want all this. Yeah, you're right. I was thinking there's. I was thinking of myself. Computer. You know, more parts. I wonder if they, uh, I'm getting the feeling that these are a little bit older computer parts too. So I don't know. So look them up. People buy stuff to make those gaming computers. I don't know what all they are in search of. Probably no recent way. technology. But we don't know for sure on those. We'll figure that out. I know people recycle it. What are those? Yeah, I thought those were napkin rings, but there's some sort of crafting crafting supply, basically. Was that the last thing? Yeah. They always save the crappy box for last. Oh. Well, why not? So I guess that's it. We have another another locker that we've actually already bought that we're going to be cleaning out and hopefully get the video put together and and posted pretty soon. Also, we're just going to sweep up and get out of here. We want to say thanks for watching and stuff. Thanks for watching. <laughs> See you soon.